CSV Connector for Excelsius 2008 is a robust connectivity alternative allowing you to connect live data to your dashboard without a reliance on XML or web services. Upon installing CSV Connector within Excelsius 2008, it's instantly made available in the data manager. CSV Connector has a series of properties that allow you to define not only where the CSV data comes from, but also additional transformations that can happen before it's loaded or bound into the dashboard. The very first property that you'll need to define is the CSV data URL. This URL can be a path on your local file system or even a URL to a remote server where you can load your CSV data. Now that we've defined where the data is coming from, we can bind our data destination. Before we do that, we obviously need to understand how many rows and columns we need to bind. For that, we've provided the Data Preview tab. By clicking on the Preview Data button, you can instantly see exactly what the CSV data looks like. And to take that one step further, we've included a Copy to Clipboard function that will take the data from this table and put it in your local file system clipboard so that you can go into your Excelsius model and paste it instantly, making it easier than ever to join live data connectivity to your standard Excelsius development practices. Returning to the property sheet, we can now define our data destination within our dashboard. Now that we understand what the standard CSV data looks like, we can refine the output even more using data output definition properties within CSV Connector. We can dynamically control the start column and end column indexes, start row and end row indexes, and a new filter column functionality that allows you to restrict the data in its entirety before it's loaded into the dashboard. In this case, we want to use the start row index so that we can ignore the first row within our CSV file. So I can click on Start Row Index. I can bind or manually enter in the row where we'd like to start our data. If I want, I could also restrict the number of columns that we bring back from the CSV connector. So I'm going to enter a end column index as the number 5, which tells CSV connector to only bring back the first five columns of data. At any point during configuration, I can go back to the Data Preview tab, re-preview the data, and to see exactly what the CSV data will look like as I bring it back. I can recopy to my clipboard and repaste at any time, saving valuable development time. The last feature available in CSV Connector is Filter Columns. Filter Columns allows you to restrict the number of rows that come back into the dashboard using a simple filter capability. When using Filter Columns, you need to define one cell per column of data within your destination range. When using filter columns, you, you can use the asterisk character to tell the property to load all associated rows for that column. In this case, for region, we've entered the value west, which will tell CSV Connector to only load rows of data where the value west is included. When we go back to the Data Preview tab and click on Preview Data, CSV Connector will honor filtered rows so that you can test and play around with it as you go, making troubleshooting easier than ever. Finally, we have the Usage tab, which provides all of the standard refresh options available with the other out-of-the-box Excelsius connectivity options. With CSV Connector, you can refresh on load, refresh on a time-based interval, or even using a trigger cell. Before we preview our dashboard, we'll go ahead and clear out all of the data, which in this case are Fortune's top 100 companies to work for. Upon clicking on Preview, CSV Connector will fetch all of the data from the CSV file and apply any filters or row and column indexes that we've defined. In this dashboard, we've bound our region filter to a dropdown, which during runtime allows us to reconnect to the CSV file and reapply our filter without any performance implications at all. You can download this sample Excelsius dashboard as a template and test for yourself how easy and quick it is to connect live data to your dashboards with CSV Connector.